El misionero dijo que ellos están ayudando a Jefferson y a su familia, pero que necesitan más ayuda y que nosotros podemos ayudarlos desde aquí. ¿No es increíble? Además, somos niños de la infancia misionera y nuestro lema así lo dice. Los niños ayudan a los niños. Podemos ayudar a todos los niños y niñas. Like the children in this video, thousands of kids from all over the world belong to the missionary childhood. It's an initiative that promotes worldwide solidarity among children and where the little ones play a key role. Cuando la ópera fue nata, When the mission first started, kids were the ones who benefited the most. Now, thanks to the work of the missionary childhood, they have a key role to play. That is, the church belongs to everybody, kids, teenagers, and adults. The Pontifical Society of the Missionary Childhood was founded in 1843 by French Bishop Charles de Forbin Jensen. He believed the kids should also have a voice in the church and that they have a lot to give as missionaries. So how can children be missionaries? The founders said that praying a Hail Mary every day and giving some money every month was enough. And that's what we ask kids, and that's how kids help each other. That's the theme of missionary childhood. All the funds for the Pontifical Society of the Missionary Childhood come from the money that children give. They use it for new projects to help other kids in need throughout the world. Children are very generous. They don't work like adults, obviously, but are very generous. Even more than adults, because the kid that, for example, is given a euro for cleaning a parish will give it all to the fund. And an adult would say, let's see, what expenses do I have? Once children understand how their money will be spent, they become very generous. Their generosity paid for more than 3,000 different projects in 2013. They range from social to educational initiatives dedicated only to children all over the world.